kid-friendly TV. Hey guys, today we're going to be making Girl Scout cookies with this Girl Scouts cookie oven. This oven looks really neat and the cookies look really yummy. Today we are going to be making Thin Mints. With the Girl Scouts cookie oven, you can bake all your favorite cookies like tree foils, chocolate peanut butter, thin mints, caramel coconut, and peanut butter sandwich. Let's go ahead and open the box up so we can start making some cookies. Here's the Girl Scout cookie oven. Awesome. With the Girl Scouts cookie oven, you get a baking pan. You also get this really cute pink double-sided spatula. Some instructions. These instructions look really helpful and they show you step by step how to make your cookies. And you get the Thin Mints cookie mix and the mint chocolate coating to go on top. And you also get the perfect cookie measuring tool. First we need to turn the Girl Scouts cookie oven on and let it preheat for 5 minutes. While the cookie oven is preheating, let's spray the baking pan with cooking spray. Now let's mix up our cookie batter. We're going to pour in the whole packet of cookie mix. The cookie mix smells so good, it smells like chocolate. Next, I'm going to grab the perfect cookie measuring tool and measure out nine milliliters of water. Perfect. Now we're gonna add it to our cookie mix. I'm gonna grab a spoon and start stirring this up. At first, it doesn't look like it has enough water with your cookie mix, but if you keep stirring and working with it, it turns into a nice, thick batter. Now that we have our cookie batter, let's put the cookies onto the baking pan. Now that we have our six cookies on the baking pan, Let's bake them in the cookie oven. I'm just gonna insert them right here. And we're gonna slide this all the way over to the right. Now we just have to wait eight to nine minutes for our cookies to bake. I'm gonna go ahead and grab a plate with some wax paper and put that on there as the next step. The cookies only have about two minutes left and they're smelling really, really good. The cookies are done now. It's been almost about eight to nine minutes, so we're gonna go ahead and slide it on over to the center here where the arrow is. And this is the internal cooling chamber. This is where our cookies are going to cool off so we can go ahead and get ready to ice them up with some chocolate. It's now been about 10 minutes in the cooling chamber so we're going to push this on back. We're going to use the other side of the spatula here to grab our cookies. We're using a mitt to hold this with because it's pretty hot. Now we're going to use our spatula to grab the cookies, put them on our plate with the wax paper. They smell really good. 
I'm going to go ahead and put these in the refrigerator so they can cool off for about five minutes. I just washed the baking pan and we're going to get our mint chocolate and put that into the baking pan. These smell really good too. Look at all the chocolate chips. We're gonna put the baking pan up here so the chocolate can melt while the cookies are in the refrigerator cooling off. Look at the chocolate chips, they look so yummy and they're even starting to melt. Now that the chocolate is all melted, let's decorate our cookies. They look so yummy. Chocolate smells really, really good too. I think actually putting them into the chocolate and using a spoon to kind of turn them around is a lot easier than using a knife. The chocolate started to harden up a little bit, so I melted the chocolate a little more on top of the cookie oven because it's so much easier to apply the chocolate when it's really melted. Now that we have all the cookies decorated with the chocolate, we're going to return the cookies to the refrigerator for about five minutes so the chocolate can harden up and set up really nicely. I just got the cookies out of the refrigerator and they are ready to eat. They look really good. I can't wait to try one. Here's a closer look at one of the cookies we made today. Looks really good. I'm gonna try a bite. That is really yummy. It's just like the Thin Mints Girl Scout cookie. That's what the inside looks like. The Girl Scouts cookie oven is amazing. It is so much fun to use and just so easy to do. I am so glad that we got to make some Thin Mints today. They were really, really yummy. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please don't forget to subscribe for more daily fun toy videos. Let's see if the babies like Elmo. Hey babies, it's Elmo. Hey baby. Oh. You're not that over, baby. Over. Give Elmo a kiss. Mm -hmm. Oh, don't bite me.